Well, you guys, everyone needs one of these home security systems. This is the VZoom, and it is the 4K 8-channel NVR security system. It's 5 megapixel PoE CCTV security system for your home. Now, this is pretty affordable because it comes in around about £259 after you add the £90 voucher. Two-year warranty, and it also records 24-7. It got a two terabyte hard drive already pre-installed inside here as well, which means you don't need to worry about running out of space. You get everything you need to get up and running. You've got your four bundles of cable here, which is your Ethernet cable. This means these cameras are powered by uh, Ethernet, which means it's power over Ethernet. So four of these are in the kit as well. Plus you get your fixtures and fittings here for the cables. These are making it water tight. You've also got your raw plugs, your screws, and your alum key to change the position of the camera. The camera itself is pretty decent. It's made of metal and plastic. You get four of them in the kit, and these are 5 megapixel with 4K resolution. Now, the angle of view here is horizontal 93.2 with vertical 50.2. It can be adjusted with an alum key, which comes in a kit, which means you can put it into the position that you require. And again, these can be powered by either power over Ethernet, which is powered by your Ethernet cable, or you can power it with a power adapter if you want to use power adapters with these. You can pull these little caps off here, and the power adapters don't come in the kit, but if you do want to power it with a power adapter, these are just standard power adapters. And then you've got your reset button on there as well. Both are uh, watertight with watertight uh, caps on them. You've got your template here to put it onto the actual wall you also have a micro sd slot here in case you want to have additional backups on your micro sd card slot here now these are day and night cameras you can use them indoors or outdoors now the ir range on these is up to 100 feet and this does support uh, motion detection as well now with the eight channel mvr box it means you can add up to another four more cameras if you wish to add more at a later date does come with all the kit that you need to get these mounted to the wall with a template, which makes it super easy to get these up and running. So you've got four of these cameras in the kit. Let's take a quick look at the specifications down at the bottom right here. You can pause this and read these at your own leisure, but these are the camera specifications that you can expect with these particular types of cameras. Now the detail you can expect to see on these cameras is superb, as I'll show you a little bit later on in the video i'll show you some daytime footage and some nighttime footage i'll also show you basically all of the uh, settings for the cameras as well so to adjust these you just use the allen key here and you can twist and turn this to get this into the perfect position that you want your camera to be in and once you're in that position you just use the allen key to tighten this up to lock it into position and then it won't move so super easy uh, mechanisms here to get these set up. Setup is super easy. Just run your cables to the locations you want, mount the cameras in those locations, plug in your Ethernet uh, cable, and then basically plug in your Ethernet cables to the MVR box, and then plug in the MVR, and you should get display. So you've got all your manuals here on how to set this up. Super easy. I've done videos on this in the past, so you can check out some of my library on how to do this. But basically, you're going to need this as well, which comes in a kit, which is your MVR box. So you can see here, 4K Ultra HD Supreme uh, Resolution H.265 Power Over Ethernet. Up to 12 terabyte storage if you want to add additional uh, storage. Also, we've got remote view, peer-to-peer -peer QR code access, and Obviv compatible as well. All the cables are IP67 rated, which makes them waterproof. And again, let's get the... Uh, MVR box out of here so you can see it's pretty well packed with some bubble wrap on here as well to protect in transit so you can see a very nice looking MVR box you've got a couple of USB ports on the front here which are USB 2.0 you got your LED display here nice looking MVR box on the rear this is where all the business happens we've got our PoE ports here these are eight of them which means it can take up to eight uh, cameras on this device we also have out LAN on here as well and our audio in and out for this uh, so these do have the LED lights on here to show you that there is data traveling down there as well to show you they are working 
We also have a VGA here in case you want to plug this into some sort of monitor. We do have HDMI on here, another USB port on here, have alarm IO and our power switch and our DC 48 volt input. So pretty easy to set up as you can see here. Just quickly show you inside here. It does come with a Western Digital Purple two terabyte drive in here, which means it's the correct drive for this particular type of unit because these are designed for uh, CCTV. So there's no worries about having cheap hard drives in here. It does have a proper Western Digital drive in here. The inside looks very well built and uh, good quality. Also, you're going to get your box with all your uh, mouse and your power cable, your power adapter, and all your other bits and pieces that you're going to need, like your Ethernet cable to go from the MVR box to your router and a bunch of other stuff inside here. So everything you need to get up and running. So let's take a look at the uh, camera here. This is 4K, uh, 5 megapixel in daytime footage. Yes, it's indoors. Again, it's going to be even better outside because you're going to get more light. The detail is there, as you can see. You would definitely be able to recognize someone's facial features with this particular camera. It's super high quality. It really is. And again, you've got your menu system down here. You can control this remotely via the app from the Google Play Store. And again, looking at the playback section here, you can choose which camera you want to play back the footage from. Do a time search. You've got your picture grid here, which will have all your pictures in here and your videos. So you can choose which camera and timestamp and find that event very quickly and easily. And you've got your backup list here as well. So you've got your date, time and all that sort of stuff inside here. So if you need to find some footage, it's super easy. And uh, this, this system is very, very good at doing that. So let's take a look here at the button here. You've got your power system, playback and admin. Again, you can right click here as well. And you've got a nice little menu system here for system, network, record, channel and alarm. You can set up all your motion detection and all that sort of stuff inside here as well. So you can see we've got a bunch of settings inside here. I've turned off some of these here, but if you want to toggle these on, so you can set up your event actions and also you can set up your detection area and also your schedule if you want to. And again, this is the sensitivity area. You can change all this here as well. So remember, this will be outside. You can set this up to where you want on your outside of your home. And you can do this individually for all your cameras here. So very, very useful. You've got human detection. Also, you've got your alarm system here. And again, it's super easy to work with. If you've never worked with one of these before, once you get it all set up, you've got your little tabs at the top here for network, system, alarm, record, and channel. So at £259, you're getting four cameras and the MVR box with all these features. Two terabyte uh, R drive inside there. And again, you can control these five megapixel with 4K resolution cameras. That's a pretty decent deal uh, by today's standards because some of that stuff is pretty expensive right now. You can control all of your disks here. You can format them. You can also check your disk to see whether the disk has any sort of bad sectors uh, and things like that from in inside here as well. You've got your FTP access as well. If you want to set that up, you can do. And your record schedule here as well. Now, if we right click on the desktop here, we can change some of the image settings here for our on-screen display. You can also set up the microphone. It does have microphone on here and you can set up the encoder and all that sort of stuff on here as well. You've got your privacy zone here, which you can mess around with. And also you've got your microphone settings all in here as well. Uh, you've got your encode and your uh, brightness, sharpness, contrast, saturation. You've got your scene, your exposure, your white balance your day and night, noise uh, reduction, and in large image as well. You've got indoor, outdoor. So you've got loads of features and settings you can mess around with inside here, but basically it works straight out of the box. The day and night uh, camera settings here, they're set to auto here, but you can change these as well uh, to whatever you like. So if you like it black and white, you can do. But nighttime generally comes out in color, which looks really well. I'll show you that in a second. So we'll take a look at some uh, nighttime footage as well so you can see what it looks like uh, in complete darkness so you'll get an idea of what it looks like. Now, remember, we've got uh, the motion detection as well, and you can have that set to an alarm if you want to. Uh, motion detection is okay, but, I mean, when you're recording 24-7, it's just basically going to record everything on the MVR box to that two terabyte hard drive day and night, 24 seven, 365 days of the year. 
So you would always have footage available. So if you needed to uh, go back and find a piece of footage that happened a week ago, you can easily find that footage and then, you know, present it to the insurance company or the police or whatever it is you need to present it to. So let's take a look at the nighttime here and you'll be blown away by how high quality uh, this nighttime footage is. Now it does have some security features to log in, which you can set up as well. Uh, you've got your uh, recovery section and also your login area here, which you can uh, set up as well, which makes it very difficult for people to just look at the main control panel. Also, we've got some night footage here. And yes, it is nighttime. It is dark in that room. It's pitch black. And you can see we're getting some night footage here uh, from the camera and it is coming up color. So you can have this set to black and white if you wish uh, in the settings, if you want to set that up as black and white, if you prefer black and white. But again, it is color and this will make it look like it's uh, daytime when really it's actually nighttime. You've got loads of other features inside here as we've already covered some of these. I'm not going to go through all of this, but basically you can set this up uh, inside here. Let me just quickly show you the day and night area here and go to uh, black and white. So go to night mode here and we're going to apply this and this will be set to uh, a black and white here and this is a, on the a black and white setting and again you can see here ultra high definition quality as you would expect and you would even pick out details here you can pick out number plates you'd be able to pick out facial recognition on this no problem at all there is an app you can download i'm not going to go through that part in this video but again it would be able to control exactly what you see there on the app uh, with your phone so you'd be able to remotely connect up and see uh, the cameras from your phone as well so pretty awesome uh, bit of kit here and if you're looking for a home security system and didn't want to spend a load of money then 259 pounds with that 90 pound voucher is a pretty decent deal if you ask me for four cameras which are 4k 5 megapixel and you can have up to eight cameras on that NVR box. You get the NVR box with two terabyte hard drive, all the cables, all the fixtures and fittings. Literally everything you see in this video, you'll get in the kit. And it's a pretty awesome deal if you ask me. I'll leave all the links and information in the video description if you are interested and if you're looking for a, a home security system. In this day and age, it's a must have better kit. Anyway, my name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Hope this video has been some sort of use to you. All the information will be left in the video description, so check that out. Also, if you enjoy this sort of content, then give the video a like. And let me know in the comments section below whether you do have a home security system in your home. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Catch you in the next one. Bye for now.